There was a young man, Ken Robcott, who had gone to uh, Medgar Ever's wife. Uh, Murley had written a book about, uh, about Medgar, and Robcott was getting nowhere with it. And I think he finally specced the script himself or something. And he came to me and said, you think we can set this up? So we took it to CBS. And uh, they ordered a rewrite, and we got a script, but went in a dumper. They didn't, they didn't, I mean, who wants to do, you know, the assassination of a black civil rights leader? Didn't, I mean, somebody wanted to, but somebody else didn't want to. And um, I have to give Ken a lot of credit for this because, frankly, I, at the time that it happened, I was not that well. And um, uh, Ken did something I have to tell you I would never thought of. He went to Washington, he got the NEA and the NEH to put up $500,000 a piece or a million bucks to make this. Now, believe me, it was a labor of love for us to do it because there was not any money in it. But people like Michael Schultz, who was a great director, worked for Scale, Howard Rollins, Ruby D, they all worked, you know, for Zippo. And um, we ended up doing a picture in Atlanta, Georgia, non-union, for just about a million bucks, maybe a little bit more. Unfortunately, at the time, I ended up with a bypass. I had coronary problems, and I was pretty much out of the loop. So I can't take a lot of personal credit. I can only take credit for being passionate about it because Edgar Evers was, was a brave man. You know, Martin Luther King marched with a lot of people. Jesse Jackson marched with a lot of people. But Medgar Evers walked down the streets of Jackson, Mississippi by himself. He walked down there with the rednecks where they throw the grenades. And he got blown away. And, of course, you know, just recently they, I mean, Robert Rob Reiner tried to make a movie. You know, De Beckwith was brought to trial. and. Right. And Rob tried to make a picture with Murley about it, but it, it, it failed. But I I was I just believe that, you know, I don't think I'd be brave enough to do what Medgar Evers did. And that's why I wanted to do everything I could to see that I got made. Didn't want an image award from the AACP.